12th of February 2023, Sunday, Sunday night, St. Petersburg, Russia. I'm in a great place, the corner of Nevsky Prospect and the embankments of Moika River. One of the most beautiful views of the city. Return from Chelyabinsk and now already in St. Petersburg. We are getting back to the streets of St. Petersburg and not only. Right now we will go to the oldest Lutheran church in the city, Annan Kirche or St. Anna's Lutheran Church that was founded here yet in 1704, just one year after the city of St. Petersburg itself was founded. However, at first there was the wooden building. Now that building, even though rebuilt in 1779, however, 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 it is like still, it's like also like one of the oldest buildings in St. Petersburg. So we go there for a concert, for a concert. For a concert, Wolfgang Amadze Mozart requiring his last unfinished masterpiece. He started that in 1791 and then died. His students, Franz Javier Sismeyer, finished that by his uh, drafts. Okay, so let's begin this. Let's begin this. Let's begin from here. From Hamoika River. Now we'll go all the way to Kirchne Street. Recently, about, about a week ago, I was taking you to another concert in Alan Kirche. At Alan Kirche. And uh, back then, uh, you really loved that. I was taking you to the concerts of Antonio Vivaldi, The Four Seasons, and I loved the reaction. And you guys were asking for more, and uh, so I'm looking forward to bring you more stuff. More stuff, Anand Kirchem. Uh, a little bit more than a week ago, back then, that was the concert performed by the Olympic Orchestra. The Olympic, that's how it's called. The symphony orchestra called Olympic Orchestra. And now there will be the whole choir. The choir and symphony orchestra of the Youth Opera Theater. The Youth Opera Theater. It's gonna be cool. And also again, there will be an artist working for for the visuals special for us um, in the real time and that's all we're creating a great atmosphere now i'm on nevsky prospects the corner with Balsha Kanyushina, the grand horse stable streets And uh, later we will turn to the embankment of Gribayedov Canal. We are going all the way to Kirchne Street. By the way, the street which is named after Anand Kirche. Marsha, 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 Fidelio Lights, Harv, Ashok Potu. Lola Guacamole, Judy Butterfield, Stephen Mucha, Yusuf Fasser, Oleg Zell, Greg McMillan, Silvana Hori, Ryan Tafula, Joan Wisnowski, Matthew F., Kony C., Alexander Brizhnoy, Denise Antunes, Beth Hombre, I say hi to everybody, and of course to Maria and Nicholas Robinov. Sergei Shripilov and everybody. Another Lutheran church. That's St. Peter and St. Paul Lutheran Church. I was taking you here too. 
the concert there goes all the time as well. I've purchased the ticket online. The tickets online, by the way, Albina, my wife, will join us. Um, she's already going there, and uh, she's actually gonna gonna take the seats for us. The thing is, in Adenkirchen, when you buy the ticket, there is no there is no certain seats. You just buy the tickets and that's it. And uh, your seat is the one that you will occupy, okay? So uh, that's why I asked Albina to come a little bit earlier and uh, to try to occupy a better places for us. Meanwhile, St. Petersburg giving here its own vibe with the street musicians singing the most popular pop and rock songs. And now here, I'm turning to the embankment of Gribaedov Canal. Another pretty significant church, Church of the Savior on Spilled Blood. Sabrina Fair, you're going to a concert, Moser's Requiem. Yes, as it's stated in uh, as it's stated in the title of my video. As far as you know, I never use the baits. I mean, my videos are like my titles are exactly like what I'm gonna show. More of street, street musicians here. On this corner also the musicians, but now they are on the break. Hi Duma. Hi everybody. Continue joining. 40 minutes to go. For the concerts. And in this live stream, I connecting, or should I say, uniting two great things about St. Petersburg. Beautiful architecture, nice walk, and the great city, and an amazing concert, amazing music. Wolfgang Amadei Mozart, one of the most significant composers of the world. He is Austrian, born in 1756. It's too bad he died only in the age of 35. I mean, imagine how, how many great melodies, how many great masterpieces he has would compose. If he would not die that early. It's like, you know, Tchaikovsky. I was saying that for Tchaikovsky dying in the age of 53 was earlier. But Dave, Mozart, Mozart, 
It's like even earlier than that, 35. The age of 35. So it's like younger than me. I'm 38 now. Italian square streets, the Italian streets. Peter the Great really loved the Italian architecture. And in the end of the street there on the uh, embankment of Fontanka River, there had to be the palace, which uh, uh, was supposed to be called Italian Palace. So the Italian Palace, they, they are never constructed, but uh, they already call this street Italian and it's still called Italian. And this is Italian Bridge. Funny story about this bridge. This just a walking bridge. Back in the days, it was a like a privately built bridge. I mean, on the money of a private person, the entrepreneur. Um, it was considered that, well, people here will pay money for walking through this bridge, but nobody really paid money. And uh, so then he actually gave it away to the city. Uh, because uh, because like no because like nobody was paying the money for that however he had to pay uh, to pay to take care of that and uh, when he gave it away to the city so actually he got it out from his balance to the balance financial balance of the city Mozart was a favorite composer of Piotr Tchaikovsky. That's not surprising, you know. That's not surprising. And then, you know, Dmitry Shostakovich was getting an inspiration of, like, from Piotr Tchaikovsky. Uh, Dmitry Shostakovich, one of the most significant Russian composers ever. Uh, he was saying that, well, every time he... Uh, um, was getting into complicated situations in terms of like uh, composing the music and he was not sure how to how how better to compose this or that moment and uh, I mean how to make it better in terms of like if I can say so musicality so he said that he was saying that he was addressing to Piotr Tchaikovsky and uh, was watching his works and was watching how Tchaikovsky works, which uh, tricks he used. So, Church of the Savior on spilled blood, literally on a spilled blood, on a spilled blood of our Emperor Alexander the seconds right next to right behind the uh, church of the savior and spilled bloods so there's an imperial horse stables and uh, that is where the carriage of alexander the seconds was riding to when here they already had the bomb prepared to explode and they are exploded that in the moments when Alexander II's carriage was riding here. Alexander II was wounded and later died. It's really beautiful church. And notice that here is no any painted elements. I remember how a year ago they were renovating the main dome. Now they started taking care of us. this dome. There are scaffoldings. Mikhailovsky Garden, the St. Michael's Garden. It's 
right behind the Mikhailovsky Palace or St. Michael's Palace, which is now the uh, Russian Museum. Nicholas Romanov, is there anything wrong with a nation, Sergey? Uh, let me check. Oh, Nicholas and Maria Romanov. 5,000 rubles? Mrs. Albina, happy birthday. Please accept our gifts and apologize for the delay. God bless all. Wow, thank you very much. Thank you very much for such a great gifts for Albina. Albina's birthday was uh, eight days ago at the 4th of February. And this was the reason why I went nowhere in terms of my trip around Russia, in terms of my trips around Russia, because, excuse me, but there is nothing more important than my wife's birthday. Oops, oops, oops. Thank you guys, thank you very much. Uh, soon I will meet Albina, she is already must be there at Anankirche, and I will tell her Awesome, right? So look. Now this is Church of the Savior on Spilled Blood and right behind it the Imperial Horse Tables. That is it. Now there goes a huge process of remodeling the place, making it a public space. They will do their best from one side to leave it look exactly as it used to be from the outside but inside to adapt it to adapt it to what people need nowadays to make a public space out of it and uh, fortunately here in uh, St. Petersburg the people are a big specialist regarding how from one side to leave the historic look of the facilities from another side to adapt it for the recent needs of people like look nobody needs nobody needs the horse table nobody needs the horse tables here at least in the center of the city so the only chance to give it a second life to make something else and the best thing to make a public space out of it. And we saw the great examples of how they were turning the old places into the public spaces. For example, Sevkabel port, a former port of Northern Cable Factory, founded yet by Karl Siemens. Then there's uh, the so-called loft project Etage, what means the floors it's a former bread baking plant amazing restaurant by the way and now here we can see Moika river again this is Moika river ho ho Remember how in the summertime I'm taking you for a ride on the river boats. Everything is so beautiful and green. Now it's also beautiful, but white. By the way, the snowfall recently, and now it's look it looks more beautiful than looks a couple days ago the snow makes everything more beautiful just look at this whoa
Meanwhile, less than 30 minutes. Less than 30 minutes to the beginning of the concert. Лана С, Альбиночка, с днем рождения. Альбиночка, happy birthday. Thanks so much, Лана. О, oh, Альбина, Альбина sent the photograph on WhatsApp. Wow, look, she's already, she's already occupied. She's already occupied a great seat for us. Wow, Альбиночка. Okay, I wrote her that we're going. I'm coming. I guess she can see now. St. Michael's Castle. Mikhailovsky Castle. Yeah, dude. This is the castle. Mostly we have the palaces, but this is castle. You see, dudes? Так. You see, dudes? Now I never cross the street. You know why? Because I saw the traffic light with with no final countdown, and I just told you yesterday when I was in Chelyabinsk that now I got used to the final countdown so much that when I see the traffic lights without the final countdown, I feel pretty uncomfortable that is the place which is called Mars Fields Mars Evopolia and that is the summer garden the summer garden the garden which was founded yet by Peter the Great. There is his summer palace inside. You know, such a modest looking summer garden and summer palace, I mean. Gavrikova Irina, hi there. Thank you so much for uh, amazing stream from Chelyabinsk. Ready to listen to music with you in our hometown welcome welcome you see i do my best i do my best for a great and various content because i want to continue bringing my channel to even better level Okay. Hi, Mikolai. Hi to Poland. Hi to all over the world. Hi, guys. By the way, usually I never asking, but can you now please write where are you from?
the summer garden which is now not summer garden more like winter garden okay please write down guys where are you from uh, Nicholas and Maria Romanov, our dear friends and brother Sergey, you deserve so much love, respect and appreciation and this is our simple gift just for you. Whoa, thanks so much. Whoa, whoa, 6,500 rubles for my great work. This is awesome. Awesome, guys. Thank you. Thank you. And I guys believe you, uh, I, I guys um, remember I remember what you were asking me to show the summer garden in a winter time. Okay, will do in the nearest days. Thank you, guys. Gavrikova Irina from St. Petersburg. Joan Wisnowski from Seattle, Washington. Steve Mucha, Air Kansas, United States. Baikots, Egan, Minnesota, United States. Ryan Merring, South Africa. Todd Smith, Pennsylvania, United States. Zrinkov Rangers, Croatia, Danger Rus, Germany, O, oh, Toronto. All right. Walter Capistrano, Brasilia, Brazil. Lola Guacamole, Gilbert, Gilbert, Arizona. Harf, Devon, England. Denver, Colorado. Nathan Augustin, Manuel Jorge, Portugal, Anna V. Enots, Houston, Texas, Eva Barbara, Tanzania, Joe O'Hara, Sacramento, California, A. Victor, New York City, Point C. Houston, Texas. Awesome geography. Look, Fantanka River. I now have the external microphone. It's windy today, but I got external microphone and I hope it helps. I hope it helps. Eric Nielsen, Denmark, transporting South Africa. Cool, cool. We have a wide geography. Porto Alegre, Brazil, Denise Antunes. That is cool. Fabius, Fabius, Italy. Greg McMillan, North Carolina. Malibu Hills, California, swelling sausage. That's great. We are now on Pastel Street. Pastel. He was one of the Decembrists. Yes, we are global. That's brown. Wagner is better. Thank you for the super chess. Well, for each its own. Uh, however, better, it doesn't mean that Mozart is like bad. You just find Wagner better. For me, it's really hard to say which composer out of my favorite ones I'm finding as my favorites. Because look, uh, how, can I, how can I say who is better? Let's say Tchaikovsky or Rachmaninoff. Or who is better, Tchaikovsky or Shostakovich? I mean, they all are like great, but have some different styles. But both are absolutely great. Let's say the symphony number two or piano concerto number two of Rachmaninoff are absolutely amazing. But in the same time, the piano concerto number two of Shostakovich or uh, the symphony number five Symphony number no. 7, Symphony number no. 10, they are also absolutely great.
Symphony number five. Or, for example, Shostakovich. Uh, Shostakovich um, Chilo Concerto number one. Awesome. All right, Pastel Streets, the corner, the corner with Mohovaya. Yes, Leopold, Kazan, Moscow. You're, you're born in Kazan, living in Moscow. Mohavaya Streets. By the way, that's the residential building where Yuri Shevchuk is living. The, uh, the guy from Ofa, born and raised in Ofa. But we got, but we got his rock group, which is called DDT, DDT. Popular move to St. Petersburg, now living here on Mohovaya Street. This guy is showing pa. Some kind of pa. All right, now I'm just going to turn to Litini Prospect. Litini means Fondry. Fondry Avenue, because back in the days here was like many Fondry enterprises. So now turning to the left and on the next intersection turning to the right, that will be Kirchne Street. Kirchne from the word Kirche, named after Annam Kirche, where we go. Литейный проспект. And there's already Kirich now. green line nativity church was there Yes, Steven Mucha, I was humming symphony number seven of uh, Shostakovich. 15 minutes to go. Great timing.
Okay, I'm not gonna run. Okay, meanwhile, if you just shouldn't let me tell you that right now we are going to the classical music concerts at Anankirche, Wolfgang Amade, Mozart, the Requiem, the very last and unfinished masterpiece of this great Austrian composer, which was finished in 1792, next year after his death by his student Franz Javier Schismeyer by the draft which uh, Mozart had time to make before he died. One of the most significant, most beautiful, at the same time tragic masterpieces. Now it will be performed at Anankirche, an old Lutheran church in St. Petersburg. It will be performed by the uh, choir, the whole choir now will perform before us, or for us, the choir and symphony orchestra of the Youth Opera Theater of St. Petersburg. And there will also the artists working for us, making the visuals right in the real time. It's going to be cool. Albina, my wife, is already there, occupied a good places for us. Because, you know, here, by the way, the ticket's uh, price is 22 bucks or 1600 rubles. But, you know, here you never buy a certain, a certain seats. Here you just buy the ticket and that's it. Your place is the one you will occupy. I purchased the tickets yet two days ago because, well, in Anankirche they always have the sold out. Today, just for curiosity, I checked that out and I saw that it sold out for today's concert too. <clears throat> and now, the building of Anankirche itself, it's like now really became so unusual, so iconic after in 2002, there was a huge fire. There was a huge fire. And even though they started like restoring that, well, mostly like it's burnt out inside. So from outside, they already refreshed that, but inside yet a lot of work. And uh, for this reason, we can see like very unusual interior. Like we, we can still see uh, the aftermath of the fire. And now they even want to leave that look, even when they will finally, uh, finally and completely and completely renovate it. Because now it has already became a part of the history. So this is Anankirche. Look, uh, the connection is always great there. Because you see, actually, here is the windows everywhere. Because this building was constructed in 1779, before the electricity. And uh, they were neat, the uh, natural light. Now it's just like, you know, covers with the blackout curtains, something like that. But those curtains are not a problem for... LTE waves. All right, so I purchased the tickets just online. Now it's like everywhere in St. Petersburg. The ticket just coming to email. Uh, all you need is just to show the barcode, they will scan it, and that's it. Nine minutes to go.
300 people in line, rated grades. <laughs> The posters, concerts goes here all the time. I was already taking you here to Vivaldi, Mozart, Astor Piazzolla, the music of Russian ballet, Karl uh, Orff and Carmina Burana. I remove I removed the external microphone. I think now for a concert will be better just uh, built in microphone of uh, iPhone, which is giving a nice stereo light working perfect when no wind. Okay, now here you still can see the consequences of the fire of 2002. now considered it's one of the most Instagrammy places yeah and St. Pete I already hear the first announcement. It's time to go. The first announcement is done. And Albina is already waiting. Albinochka, who occupied a great place for us, came beforehand. So we all to have a better view. The musicians, the choir, and the musicians, the symphony orchestra of the uh, youth symphony uh, of the youth look choir and uh, symphony orchestra of the youth opera theater. chairs are here because on the stage will be the choir it's sold out you see it's sold freaking out Да, я сюда сяду, с этой стороны. Вот, Альвида, say hi. Hi. 
Передай привет Марии, Николасу, Лане. Uh, да. Романовы и Лане С. Thank you for the present gift. Thank you for the gift. Yeah, thank you guys. Jury Butterfields, thank you big time. Wow, Alvina did a great job, look. Я сказал, что ты сделал хорошую работу. Great job. Ну, то, что ты заняла место. Не, нормально, нормально. Вот смотри, как слишком близко было бы. Но я тебе сказал, что слишком близко тоже плохо. Вам будет третий ряд, и вот этот сильный. Да, седьмой бэр. Лучше. Ладно, говорит, Альбинчик, привет. Мишель Андерсон, Анастасия, Тони М, Томас Семик. Hey guys, we're about to begin. The first announcement was already done, so it's like seven minutes left, maybe five. The time is 7.58. The beginning at eight, and usually they are kind of how to say punctual 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 <laughs> in Russian language it's uh, punctual I mean like right in time ты быстро примчалась ты вообще ты без нет ты без 20 еще в душ заходила а уже в 7.20 ты здесь забыла родила Island Kirche. This is a great Sunday night, the great finishing of the great week and weekend. Enjoy with us. Mozart Requiem, the very last masterpiece of this Austrian genius. This requiem turns to be a, his own requiem. Okay, the second announcement, and that means only five minutes left. Three last calls. Two last calls already done. Are you guys excited? Let me know if you excited. I didn't say hello to everybody. You are most welcome, Mrs. Albina. Thank you, Maria. Thank you guys again. I see uh, the visitors already barely entering inside of the concert hall. JJNS. Hello. Yes, we will begin. Seems like uh, most people already inside. I see it's like full hall. It's like all seats are already taken. And uh, so now, uh, every next second, we can see, we will see how the musicians will entering. Наверное, уже подустал, да? Сидеть. 
у тебя получилось? А ты когда пришла вообще здесь, сколько примерно процентов людей было? То есть это на пятую, на одну пятую часть? Да, уж. А тут же многие кто приходит, что сначала начинают ходить тут, нахаживать. Ну что ж, придется потерпеть. Сейчас уже мы не успеем купить. Кристоф Йенсен, hi. Greetings to you to Dingle in Ireland. Тейн Айловский, hi. Элиза Редли, Лина Мамонтова, Псалм 119, Кеннет Уильямс, Свеллинг Сосаж, Стив Кембли, Сергей Иванов, We all are waiting. <laughs> 
никаких антрактов здесь нет. Окей, вы видите, люди волнованы. И уже с их клапанами, колами, музыканты на стадию. Анонимус, вау, Анонимус sent 50 баксов. And even said nothing. Thank you very much. <laughs> Gerald Pechenyuk. Hi. <laughs> come on, come on. You see people excited. It's Sunday night. I'm in Kirche. The concerts of Mozart Requiem performed by the choir and the symphony orchestra of the Youth Opera Theater of St. Petersburg, Russia. Everybody's already inside in the hall. I don't see anyone already entering out of visitors. They are fashionably late. Oh, VM, I see even you guys already clapping. Stacy Oshields, hi to you and hi everybody. We're just beginning. If you just came, let me know. You came right in time. Sold out. Everybody's waiting. Okay, finally. The choir and the symphony orchestra of the Youth Opera Theater of St. Petersburg.
Bravo. The Choir and Symphony Orchestra of the Youth Opera Theater of St. Petersburg, Russia. They just performed the Wolfgang uh, Amade Mozart's Requiem, composed in 1791. The concerts in the walls, in the burned walls of Annenkirche the first Lutheran church in St. Petersburg, Russia.
Bravo, the choir and the symphony orchestra of the Youth Opera Theater of St. Petersburg. Mozart, Requiem, and the walls of Anna and Kirche, the first Lutheran church in this city since 1704. Now you guys can understand why here every night the sold out. Bravo to great singers, bravo to the musicians, bravo the conductor, bravo Mozart. Bravo Franz Javier Sismeyer. Приглашаем вас к дополнительному выходу в правой части зала. Спасибо. People can calm down. Keep shouting. Bravo. Anastasia, thank you very much again. Hello to Hungary. I 
need to get my head on. All right, that is where together with Albina, we are finishing this weekend. Thank you all for watching and thank you for being with my channel this week from St. Petersburg to Chelyabinsk, from Chelyabinsk to Anankirche and Mozart. Thank you all for watching. Thanks for all the great words. I was reading them all because now, <clears throat> I mean, I was just uh, also was just holding the camera listening and was reading to your comments. Thanks for support. Thanks for uh, some weight. Congratulations and uh, present to Albino. Thank you very much. You guys stay tuned and keep watching. Comments, like, subscribe. See you next week. Say bye. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. From St. Petersburg, from Russia, with love and peace. Shelley Richardson, Kony C, 1978, Ginger Ale, Ashok Porch View Farm, um, Nicholas Romanov, Maria Romanov, Anastasia, Neil McDonald's, Terry Bell 3, Tizona Colada, Judy Butterfield, Yusta Gale Fasser, Natalia Krivensova, Robert Lovinzi, Emir Shah, Lilian, Michelle Anderson, Lana S, Steven Mucha, Danger Rus. We say bye to everybody. Hey, Victor, Marsha, 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 uh, Julie Butterfield, Joan Wisnowski, Carl. Secondhand Sampler, Rayana B, Cumulus Terracicus, And uh, special thanks to Albina for a good seats for us. She came 14 minutes before the concerts to take a good seats. By Kot, Podolsky Lada Live. Winnie the Book. Kenneth Williams, Night Boat, <laughs> all right, have a great weekend and the whole upcoming week.